Little Acorn, written by Melanie Joyce, published by Autumn Publishing, an imprint of Igloo Books. When I was just an acorn, nobody noticed me. I watched the world below go by from high up in my tree. I nestled under cozy leaves and sheltered from the rain, growing fat and shiny when the sun came out again. When the summer faded, the leaves turned golden brown. Bye-bye, acorn, said the leaves, floating to the ground. Wait for me, I called. Then, ready, steady, jump! Whee! I tumbled through the air and landed with a thump. Squirrel was collecting nuts for his winter store. He hid me carefully away beneath the forest floor. Underground, everything was snuggly and still. I waited very patiently for time to pass until I felt a sudden change beginning deep inside. I'm feeling so peculiar. What's happening? I cried. You're growing up, said the worms, all wriggling about. When acorns fall into the soil, at some point they will sprout. I giggled as I felt tickly, teeny tiny shoots. And before I knew it, I had sprouted little root. I started to stretch up wiggling left and right, reaching up and up till I pushed out into the light. Warmed by gentle sunbeams, my little leaves unfurled. I was so excited to be back out in the world. As the weeks and months passed by, I grew and grew and grew. Squirrel spotted me and said, I've been looking everywhere for you. The seasons changed and so did I. In sunshine, rain, and snow, my branches stretched, my trunk grew tall, my roots spread far below. Among my sturdy branches, the birds built cozy nests. My twigs and leaves made me soft, warm beds for my feathered guests. Spiders weaved their sticky webs and beetles scurried by. Squirrels scampered playfully and made their homes up high. The creatures of the forest had never seen a finer tree. I wondered, would there ever be another one like me? Then, one breezy morning, I woke up with a yawn. I stretched my branches and out jumped a special little acorn. The end.